Hello everyone, my name is Ayman and today I'm going to explain to you a very important factor influencing acidity, the inductive effect. Let's get right into it. To explain the inductive effect, let's consider two molecules, ethanol and trifluoroethanol. Here is our problem. Which molecule is more acidic? Well, we know that the acidic proton is linked to the same atom, oxygen. So bond strength and electronegativity of the atom directly bonded to the acidic proton cannot determine which compound is more acidic. Then how can we determine which compound is more acidic? We simply need to know that all electronegative atoms in a molecule can affect the acidity of a compound, not only the atom linked to the ionizable proton. This is the inductive effect. To better understand it, let's take a look at the electrostatic potential maps of the two molecules. On the left is the EPM of ethanol, and on the right is the EPM of trifluoroethanol. In an EPM, the red color indicates the negative side of the molecule, and the blue color indicates the positive side of the molecule. Here, we can notice that the region near the OH proton is more blue in trifluoroethanol. This means that the acidic proton in trifluoroethanol has a greater degree of positive charge than the proton in ethanol. In turn, this means that trifluoroethanol is more acidic than ethanol. But how can we explain this at the molecular level? At the molecular level, electronegative atoms attract electrons through the bonds. In the case of trifluoroethanol, the three fluorine atoms attract electrons through the bonds and thus disperses the negative charge that is no longer concentrated on the OH proton. The OH proton is therefore more positive and thus more acidic. This is confirmed by the pKa values of both compounds. In a nutshell, the inductive effect is very important in determining the acidity of a compound if the latter contains one or more electronegative atoms that are not directly linked to the acidic proton. This is yet another proof that structure determines function. Thank you for watching.